Peace. This is Devon Law from Devon Architecture and Construction. We're back at a law school with the law school rehabilitation. We're doing the subfloor now. Mm -hmm. So we ripped up the old floor. We're getting to uh, installing a new subfloor and going with a new finished wood flooring. Mm -hmm. And um, we're in phase one of that, but which is actually phase two of the entire project. Well, the subfloor was a different type of wood. It wasn't the uh, the normal three quarter, f I mean five eighths thickness, or basically the right type of right right type of wood. Mm -hmm. So that was what was the problem. And um, they threw a lot of self leveling cement on top of the uh, on top of the subfloor. So it, it caused the building or the floor to shift mm -hmm. over time because. Uh, the concrete laid without reinforcement has no tensile strength. So that means, you know, it stops it from flexing, it flexing and bending and staying the same. So that's what happened over time. We're gonna rip it bare and put back all new subflooring. And then we're gonna go on top of that subfloor with a new finished floor. We went with the wood floor finish, mahogany wood flooring in there, tongue and groove, three quarter inch. We did a vinyl VCT tile in the classroom. Mm. And then we're gonna go with a serentino with a, a porcelain towel for the bathroom. What are, what are some of the things that need to be done downstairs? Uh, only thing that's left now was to get rid of some of the debris. Uh, one, a, a small floor, a, a small floor slab, um, and just f uh, finish framing. Uh, the, the, the last of the wall. So I would say about 25% worth of work left down there. Mm. And we added a new uh, sink and all that and a uh, plumbing renovation downstairs also. Mm. And a new slab down in the basement also. Signing out, Devon Law, www.daaconstruction.com. Peace. I like this synth mega, do it again.